Miguel Ángel Trevino Morales. In Mexico, his name is synonymous with brutality. His face, the final image, dozens, perhaps hundreds of victims will have seen before he either carried out or ordered their slaughter. Now, after years of evading arrest, he is in the hands of the authorities. Esta mañana, en la madrugada, fue detenido. This morning at dawn, members of the Mexican Marines detained 40-year-old Miguel Ángel Trevino Morales. This person has seven arrest warrants by different federal judges and is involved in at least 12 investigations. After decades allegedly involved in organized crime, the charge sheet against Trevino is long. He is accused of organized crime, murder, crimes against health, torture, money laundering and carrying weapons that are exclusively for the use of armed forces, among others. Also known as Seta Cuarenta, Trevino was unlike other top leaders of Los Setas. Rather than having defected from the military, he was a civilian who displayed a particular penchant for extreme brutality, including allegedly dissolving some of his victims in acid. He is wanted in connection with 265 murders of migrants in the state of Tamaulipas in two separate massacres in 2010 and 11. For a man with such a reputation then, when it came to his own arrest, it was a surprisingly calm affair. He was detained by the Marines in a pickup truck with two associates carrying around $2 million in cash. Not a shot was fired in the operation, something which will please the Mexican government. Indeed, the removal of the second overall leader of the feared criminal organization in as many years, one killed, his successor now in custody, will be a source of pride for the security forces involved in tackling Los Setas. The hope must now be that the power vacuum this arrest will have created within the organization doesn't provoke further bloodshed. Will Grant, BBC News, Mexico.